Experimental Eddie made by Crazy Cray was one of our first in-store Spirit Halloween sneak peeks for the 2019 season, and today we'll be reviewing him as we review him among five different categories. Let's start. I think detail is what made this prop interesting for me. Even though the face was not 100% realistic, I think the idea of kind of like a zombie Frankenstein look with the electrifying wire serum just makes him look really cool. I love his teeth and it's just like it's kind of like his stitches on top of his head with some holes on top of it also. And I love the, I love the idea of how like um, his wires thread, do, thread through his head and then he kind of holds it with one of his arms, and it just looks very cool, honestly, in my opinion. Experiments with Eddie thrashes back and forth, while his head kind of bobbles along with it, and his arms do as well. In my opinion, I think his animation actually is pretty well done. Even though it's kind of a recycled idea from Electrified Maniac, I really think it does for this guy also, and I think it's just an, a unique concept for this guy, and it just, it just works well with him, honestly. Experimental Eddie retails for $199.99, which is also $200. In my opinion, I think this price is really well worth it. When I first saw Eddie, I really thought he was going to be $230, knowing that Spirit Halloween does like to overprice a lot of their animatronics. So I really did see this guy being $230. But once I figured out the price tag was only $200, I knew that I was going to have to get this guy. It's just the price tag is good, and I just love the prop overall. I feel like... Eddie is one of those props where it's like he has to be placed right to be really scary. Um, he's not exactly 100% scary, like he's not like popping out at you or terrifying or this really demonic face. He's just more of a prop that could startle somebody if when it is activated or when it's placed in the right spot. Because overall he's not very scary, but he is a kind of a creepy prop that could come off scary depending on how it's used. Experimental Eddie has okay quality, I guess, like, overall. I've seen mostly they do work, but I've seen some defective ones, too. His parts are fairly cheap, too, like his chest plate and kind of the uh, motors it has in it. And the arms, the arm metal is easily breakable. But I overall think his quality isn't the worst, but it's nothing I would go, you know, crazy about. I hope you guys enjoyed the review on the Experimental Eddie animatronic. He is overall my favorite prop of this year from the Spirit Halloween, and probably my favorite prop of the whole year. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you make sure to subscribe, and this is Halloween Haunter.